Stop going so fast. Jump. I'm jumping on the waves and get back on. Oh no. That wasn't that was a nightmare. Um let's let, let's stand in a safe location next time and like, we let check the North Star. Okay, we're good. We're good. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. That was a nightmare. The whole the whole day's been a nightmare. Ah Captain's log. We have just come to the end of day eight of our voyage. The sea has turned green. We have encountered Storm Betty. We tried to navigate around Storm Betty. Storm Betty still got us, but we got away and we dropped the quadrant overboard. But we have lots of water. We have a lot of fish. We have a lot of morale. And we've named our ship Doris. The good ship Doris. End of daily log. So looking at the map, we are past the zero mark towards Dragon Cliff. So you can see we're probably about here onwards okay we need to eat something or we're gonna pass out uh, let's have a tuna even though it's probably not cooked uh, maybe put one of these on they don't take much to cook hmm, I think the fire's gone out so let's put another firewood on Oh, these are burnt, I think. Are they? Oh, no. Okay. He may have even updated it since last. I'll cook in the daylight when I can see what's going on more. Okay, time for bed. Good morning, and you can really see how how green the sea is. It is gloriously green. No doubting about it. Are we going the correct direction? No. Let's go southeast to make up for it. Which way is the wind blowing? Make up your mind. <laughs> So the wind couldn't make up its mind which way it was blowing last night, so I just went to bed. I just had enough of it. <laughs> I was just like, I've had, I've had enough of going to bed. Sort out in the morning. I came to the conclusion that he wasn't blowing at all. But it probably is always blowing in some way. I think it just took a bit of updating. I'm not sure what's going on. But, uh, yeah, if you were direction of face, the wind was seems to be blowing head on, so... To be fair, there's no, not many waves. Which way are you blowing? All right, let's go a little bit to the left then. As long as I go in a general direction. All right, let's throw another shrimp in the barbie. Yeah, we're running low on fish here. I haven't been keeping up with the fish catching processes. I mean, I've had other issues to go to attend to, like navigation and storm, storm Betty, and come on, winds. Which Let's get on look, going hard left. Come on, just find a direction that you want to go in and go in it. I mean, that goes completely south. Southeast, maybe. Okay, let's try the sundial because we need to figure out where we are. I think we're roughly correct. We might be a bit. I think we're roughly correct. We need to eat. Do what I'm going to do is I'm going to have one of the emergency rations of lamb. I've had to fix it a bit again. Okay, so this time, right click and let's get some lovely lamb. Can I, is this cooked or do I, can I cook this? Can I add that to there and cook it? 
We've got three fish and one meat cooking, one lamb cooking. I have to keep checking we're going the right way. We are very tired because I spent our sleep patterns have all messed up because of the storms, because of fishing, because of fish, because of wind. Issues. We can probably go a bit more east, I would have thought. I can't go to sleep until I've eaten something. I might eat an uncooked lamb. And... Which I know is pretty good. I don't know how long how the cooked lamb will be. Day 9 of our maritime adventure. As we continue east, Storm Betty, a distant memory. As we try cooking meat for the first time. And we do some day sleeping. Oh no. I woke up when it's... It's raining again. The fish look cooked, the tuna looks burned. <laughs> oh my god. It's a storm to the north, no! Oh cripes. Hang on, where's the wind? Where's the wind? I think we might miss this one, because the wind is coming from pretty much the east. Well. Let's head a little bit southeast. No, the water's coming in. Don't let the water in. Oh, I think I ruined a steak. Don't cook the steaks. I think they come pre-cooked. Well, I might just try and sleep through this. Right, good night everybody. Let's wake up and check the course. We are we are really in unlucky with the wind right now. Oh crap! What's going on? Storm Sally is after us. Oh, well, I'm having trouble like steering to the east to try and get out of this wind. I thought they made tacking easier to be honest. We're at the edge of Storm Sally. Storm Sally is behind us now. But the wind has been really unlucky with us. We've been really, uh, the, wind, the wind's been really unkind to us. I'm having, well, I'm gonna pull this up and to see if it helps us turn. I wanna go to the right. Okay, now I wanna go straight. Go ahead in the southeast. Wind's blowing west. We wanna go east, not the best. You know what? I'm just gonna drink, and despite my better judgment, we're gonna get to sleep, tacking southeast to try and get out of the storm. Well, just to try and get to sleep during night time, and then we have to go north again. Yes, the morning. The wind is so bad. Can we have a change of wind direction, please? Okay, we need to go, we need to tack the other way, because obviously, obviously we've been going southeast, we need to go northeast. If we can actually tack through. Um, just finding it hard to kind of like move through the, because we're just sitting here now, probably going backwards. Yeah, that steak's ruined, isn't it? Do not ever cook steak. These fish are perfectly cooked. 
perfectly cooked. I just don't believe that. Um, I'll give you a little bit more. Well, we need to start catching fish now. Can you go all the way up? It may be the only way we can turn for it. Wow. It's, it's pointed to the southeast again, even though we're locked all the way to the left. Okay, we'll go all the way around then. It's fine. Couldn't get through the uh, the headwind. We'll go all the way around, 360. Okay, that's about it. Don't go too far because we'll never get back again. Okay, so northeast. Let's let the sail down. Okay, let's check where we are. With the sun compass, we are pretty much on target. As far as I can tell. So, there we go. We're good. All is good. Alright, I really should get back to fishing because otherwise we're going to start starving. This is actually going to be my first fish caught in green water, I believe. Unless I missed one. But it's a salmon. No, it's a tuna. <laughs> okay, on you go. Somehow we're going north. I'm not sure what happened there. Let's go back east again. Okay, this will be the fourth tuna, I'm guessing. Fourth tuna in a row. Oh, nearly broke the line there. No, it's a, um, one of those spiny ones. The ones that cook really easily. I don't give you much meat. But that's okay, blue shimmer towel, that's it. Alright, let's cook that then. I may have put two firewood in there by mistake. Again, never mind. We'll just have to pay attention and not let those overcook. Okay, looks like we've got only nine firewood left. So we've only got nine lots of cooks left. Yeah, I'm only going to use one firewood per cooking from now on. Definitely. We do have three emergency lambs left. They are the emergency lambs. If we can't find any fish in the sea, we shall use the lambs. Now, one lamb per day for three days. I think we're going to be okay. I've kind of lost track of what day we're on. <laughs> I think it's day 10, I'm not sure. Let's just quickly look at the log. Let's see what day we're on. So this is the end of the 10th day. The thing is, we, um, if you include day 33 itself, which probably we shouldn't because we kind of left it quite late. So really we've been at sea nine days. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine days really. But this is the end of the ninth day at sea proper. But we've probably got another five days at sea. We are past halfway now, so who knows? I reckon another five days. Hard to tell if they're cooked or not at night time. I think we're going to be okay in water. Water was the biggest concern. Because four barrels, which means we needed to be at halfway mark before we finish the second barrel. And we've still got half of the second barrel left. So that's good. That's good. And of course, Food we can catch from the sea, but we can't catch water from the sea. I'm going to eat this because this one cooks really fast. I don't want to burn any food. That was quite good for food, actually. That was quite good. Let's have another... I think they're all cooked, you know. Because we've got two... I think, accident... I think I might have accidentally, accidentally put two woods on. Let's take these off. I think they're cooked. I just think they are. Okay, let's... Make sure we're going in the, roughly the right direction. Uh, we may be a bit more north than we wanted to be. 
but roughly that's pretty good. Let's go a little bit south, maybe. Let's go southeast rather than northeast. Good night, everybody. Oh no, it's raining again, is it? Oh crap, it's another storm. Not another storm, no. We need to go south. Turn hard to starboard. Oh no, put her down. Hang on. No, 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 don't, 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 don't you dare. Another pull is up. This storm's worse than before. Oh, we can't get out of this way. It won't let us. Pull is all the way up and out. Let's just see if we can turn. Then we can turn. Then we're going south, more south, more south. Okay, straighten up, straighten up, straighten up. Okay, let's pull this down again. Let's let this out, let it out, let it out, let it out. If in doubt, let it out. We need to get out of the storm. My plan is not to go through the center of these storms. <laughs> If you can't go through the storm, or if you don't want to go through the storm, go around the storm. So the storm's coming from that direction there. You know, it's going to hit us on our it's going to hit us on our starboard side, but we're going directly perpendicular to the direction the storm's coming from to try and minimise the damage when it does hit us oh dear guys here it comes wow it's a big waves it's a big waves Hold on tight. Hold on to your hats. Stay out. Just got to hope Doris can withstand the battery that the sea's given us. South is best because it's directly at a right angle to the wind direction. The wind is coming from east. Of course it is. Hold on. I mean, come on, come on, Doris. You can do it. Come on. The good ship Doris.
Whoa! No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Okay, maybe time to pull this in a bit. Oh no. It's getting really heavy. Dear. Taking a batter in, batting down the hatches. What is this storm? What is this storm called? Storm Susan. They call it Storm Susan. Why is there so many storms in this part of the world? As soon as we got halfway, three storms, and not a storm before. Oh dear. But that's okay. We're gonna do it. We'll, we'll do it guys, we'll do it. I have faith in you, in me. And most of all, have faith in Doris, the good ship Doris. So far, she's holding up quite well. She's doing all right. She's doing okay. You're doing okay, Doris. You're doing all right. We haven't got the storm. Oh, we are. We have got the storm on two sides, left and right. So, yeah, we are. And we've got open sky above it, uh, to the to the in front of us. And this is a good option. We got. Uh, we can see a way out. We can literally see light at the end of the tunnel. Left side storm, back behind us storm, to the right of us storm, straight ahead. This guy. An exit, an escape route. Alright, we're thirsty. Let's, uh, let's, not, let's not scrimp on the old drinking. Let's keep this topped up while we can. So who thinks this is a good plan to go around the storms as much as we can rather than through them? Get a bejesus out of me. I felt like I felt like I blew my hat off. Put the sour down a bit more. Biscuit for a biscuit. I'll stay, I'll stay here in case I have to raise it. I feel like we're on the edge of escaping the storm now. On the edge though, but still within it. Still in the danger zone.
Come on, let us out. Storm Susan's got us still. I think we're escaping now, guys. I think we're escaping. Looking to the left, we can see the edge. I think what we might do is go a bit south, west. No, oh, yeah, south, southeast. Sorry, if I can. that looking with the wind all is in a bit look it's filling out now the storm's filling out we're right on the edge don't get caught in the headwind okay bring it up bring it up bring it up Yeah, the plan to go south is the best. Get out of the storm now. Thing is, once you get stuck in the headwind, sometimes it's hard to get out of that headwind. Sometimes when you've got a good plan, stick to the plan. Let's continue south. Take this sail down again. And let this out. Looking east, like we can see clear skies to the east. We are coming out the southerly side of the storm now. We've survived three storms. For those of you who say that they've never seen such clear skies. Well, here we are. Three storms in like three days. Goodbye, Storm Susan. Now, what do you call your storms? <laughs> Who's going to start naming the storms? Any more east? Obviously, the sea is still bumpy. Green and bumpy. But I think we're through the worst of it. I've got to just be careful this time. Let's make sure bring this up a bit but there you go guys it's been epic we're not there yet but even now it's been epic three storms three days oh crap so this fell off the, I, just got, I just fell off the ship I just got knocked overboard I'm not sure I'm not sure what happened there. Uh, um, right, let's pull this all the way up. Hang on a minute. Did I like just walk off accident or did I get knocked off? That was that was strange. I didn't lose anything, did I? Oh, I've got the fishing rod. That's the main thing. It's starting to calm down a bit. Starting to. It's been a day. It has been a day. It's been three days, but this has been a day of the three, three days. That storm has been the... That storm was the worst of the three. Oh, man. The things I do for you guys at home. <laughs> Things I do to get some dates from one place to another. Dragon Cliffs better love these dates we're bringing them. Okay, so the sun's not out, so we can't use the sundial yet. Let's go um, the other direction. Let's go north east because we went significantly south to get away from that uh, storm. The northeast should be appropriate. 
Welcome to day 10 proper in the green sea. Three storms have passed and we are sailing east. Continuing our journey. I think in the next episode we're going to arrive, we're going to get there. I've had fun. It's been stormy waters, it's been stormy seas, stormy winds. But we've got Doris, and we've got me, and we've got you, the crew. We continue our journey east on day 10. After three storms, Doris has prevailed. Thank you for being here. I think in the next episode, we're going to finally arrive at the fabled dragon cliffs. Does it even exist? Find out in the next episode of Sailwind. And as always, I have been Pothos. You have been awesome. Goodbye. <laughs>